Whoopi and I produced a show about Moms Mabley. And it came from the first Comedy Awards. When I got Whoopi to do the show. This was 20 years ago. And I said, do you remember Moms Mabley? Whoopi said, yeah. And I grew up in East St. Louis uh, part of the time. And one of the people there we knew was Pigmeat Markham and Slappy White and Red Fox and this woman, Moms Mabley. So we kind of grew up on her. So on the first Comedy Awards, Whoopi did an impression of Moms Mabley, which, which got us in trouble because they didn't really understand moms. You know? and so, uh, Whoopi came out and said, Mom, be walking down the street with her girlfriend. Girlfriend said, Moms, I smell hair burning. Mom said, maybe we're walking too fast. Well, three days later, the network called and said, what was that pubic hair joke? I said, what? I didn't know that. I, a pu I didn't. Yes, there was a pubic hair. It's impossible. So anyhow, but it was a huge hit. And Bette Midler, everybody cracked up. So since then, we've talked about doing something honoring this woman who was truly a breakthrough. She brought uh, women into prominence and funny women into prominence and proved you didn't have to look like Lucille Ball or, to be amusing and to be funny and to be accepted. So we've talked about it for like 20 years and finally Whoopi said, yeah, let's do it. And Whoopi directed it and we put together probably 25 people from Sidney Poitier and Eddie Murphy to Harry Belafonte and Joan Rivers, you know, so the good cross section of people, all of whom grew up and, and loved this, this magical woman who uh, uh, became this character, Moms. So that was very gratifying because we went back and found her early recordings. And she went from the Chitlin circuit into uh, the uh, Apollo Theater, which was the Vatican then of black show business, all the way to Carnegie Hall. And so that voyage was magnificent from this woman. And Whoopi's done a great thing. She's, she talks about moms, but she also directed it. Whoopi's a hell of a director. And uh, partially because she has been there enough, and partially because the people trusted her. It's a big thing.